Hi, my name is Belgica and I make acting related videos every Monday, Thursday and Saturday. But today I'm going to show you how to upload a video and make it unlisted like this so that only when you share the specific link will they be able to see your video. So I'm going to show you how to do it from uploading it from scratch first and then I'll show you the other ways in case you already uploaded your video. So I have my audition file here and then I'm going to sign in to my YouTube account. And I'm just going to sign into my main one. And I am using the example as a self tape audition, but really you can do anything. So now I'm logged in. I'm going to click on this camera with the plus sign create and I'm going to click on it and then upload video right here. And it's going to give you two options uh, to select your file. So you can just click on here and then you can select, you know, whatever file you would like that's on your computer or attached, or you can just click on your uh, video and then drag it right onto uh, that little arrow right there and it'll let you edit a few things while it's uploading. So the title you can edit, of course, I'm just going to leave it that as an example. And in the description, if you are doing this for a self tape audition, I highly suggest you put some contact information in your description just to make it easier for the casting director. And uh, you can put yours if you self-submitted or your agent's information, if this is um, an audition that your agents requested, your availability, sometimes they ask for that or just anything else they ask for, like, do you know how to skate or do you have a dog? You know, if it's specific for that casting call. And then at the very, very bottom, I usually, you know, go a little bit lower, but you can put notes for yourself. So the number of audition or the, you know, the date that you should hear back, whatever you would like. If you scroll down a little bit, you can also edit your thumbnail to make it look a little bit nicer. These ones are the pre-selected ones are pretty good. But uh, if you did want to select your own file, you can just click on upload thumbnail and you can select whatever file you would like. Just make sure it's horizontal so it fits. This one almost fits, but I'm just going to leave it as an example. And you can also select your playlist. So if you have one, if you want to have a playlist of all of your unlisted videos or a playlist of all of your self tape auditions, and, and then I'm going to put it's not made for kids. And then next monetization this is only available if you are monetized but i'm going to put off for any self tape audition i always put the uh, the ads to be off because i don't want to waste the uh casting director's time so i'm just going to keep going there's just a few things about monetization here and then here we are finally visibility um you can do it save publish you can do it private unlisted and then anybody with the video link will be able to watch your video or you can do it public set it as premiere make sure to click save and it's going to take you to your youtube studio so right now we're in the content and then if you click here, it's going to take you to the uh, homepage of the studio. Uh, and then let me go ahead and show you how to get to the studio from the uh, just youtube.com. So you're just going to go to the right to your channel icon or your photo. And then the third one down is YouTube studio. And then here you can see you're back at the homepage, the dashboard of the studio. And then the second one on the left is going to be the content. Um, and then you can go ahead and click on whatever you know video you would like. Here you can also edit the visibility of it uh, quickly. Just, of course, make sure to press save so that the link is available as an unlisted or you can click details, the little pen pencil, and it'll show you everything we just saw earlier, but all in one page instead of having to click next, you know, each time to find it. You can just go here and you can edit everything again, including visibility that's over here on the right side. So you can select uh, whatever you want, the same thing as earlier, uh, and then you can make it unlisted. So this way, if you already uploaded the video, you can still edit it. And this is the link you're going to share if um, you have it as an unlisted video link, because they will not be able to find it unless they have this specific link. And of course, make sure to click save. And I highly suggest that you copy and paste the link onto a new tab and make sure the link works before sending it to anybody. Because if it's not the right link, they're not going to be able to see it. They're just going to see unavailable. Um, that's how you uh, upload a video and make it unlisted. And thank you so much for watching. At the end of every video, I feature another channel. 
this is today's feature. If you would like to be featured on my next video, make sure you're subscribed, like this video, and leave me a comment.